Now, the last thing we want to talk about is moving around with your Chromebook. Um, you'll notice here at El Capitan that in our classrooms, um, we have mobile furniture. Um, we don't expect you to be sitting in rows staring straight ahead. We expect you to be working in groups moving around. Um, that being said, you do need to be careful when you are when you're using moving around with your Chromebook. Um, so you don't need to carry your Chromebook like this. Um, you definitely do not want to carry it like this. Um, there, there is no reason why you should not, when the teacher tells you to move, close the Chromebook. It boots in seconds, so there's, there's really no time lost if you close it and put it in lock mode. So once I've got it closed, then I want to carry it with both hands while I'm moving around the room. Okay, it's not a football. I don't want to hold it under my arm and, and go running through the halls. Um, so you want to you want to hold it with two hands. Um, you also want to make sure that when you put it in your backpack, um, it has some padding in there to protect it, and you can no longer toss your backpack on the floor of your bedroom when you get home. You need to set it down gently, make sure it's where no one's going to step on it or kick it, um, or or your dog's going to chew on it or anything like that. If you have younger siblings, younger brothers and sisters, you want to make sure that you keep this out of their reach. Um, even your older brothers and sisters, you don't want them messing with your Chromebook. So make sure you have someplace safe at home to keep it when it's not being used.